Okay, I am at the models and I'm gonna show you a um, plan 2400. I know you were saying based on the um, based on the floor plan, you didn't think it was large, but I feel like this one feels so much bigger than the 1900. So I just kind of want to show you. Obviously, this is the sales center, but this is what's set up as the front bedroom here. Got like a little walk-in closet. Um, you've got a pretty good size entry area here. Now what's going on on the right here, one of the salespeople is with um, clients, but that's actually the two-car garage. So that would be actually be closed off and it would just be a garage door here. You have um, just your standard little coat closet here and then a half bath. Now you could take this half bath and turn it into a full bath for just 3,700, um, which is pretty good. And then up here, we have the, um, you know, the living space. Same thing with the corner fireplace as it is right now. You could actually take that fireplace and just do it here. That would square off the corner, give you a little more room that you can have that set back and then it would be, um, you could, you know, mount your TV on top of it. But then you've got all this great space here. So you've got your um, dining area and then your kitchen. So. You've got, you know, the peninsula here, which is pretty awesome. This is a good size kitchen. This is actually um, a very similar layout to what Mark and I have in our house. And um, we love it just from the, you know, workflow thing. This is, you've got a large pantry here. You can see double door. And then let's go upstairs, which is where, and then here's like understairs storage. I'm going to show you what we've got there. So you've got a lot of space. It actually goes around the little corner there too. So tons of space. And then let's go upstairs. And you can see there's a big window there. You've got the big ceilings. And then you come upstairs. And this is a really good size landing. You've got some great storage space here. You've got a good size front bedroom. So I just kind of like this one in terms of um, you got a walk-in closet in this bedroom. I like this one because then the upstairs you can see there's a little, I don't know, a better flow to it and not just the narrow um, uh, hallway. And then here's your master. So kind of nice. You've got a large master. And you can see kind of space-wise what you have. So a lot of room. And then huge closet over here. So you've got some good closet space. I don't know if you can kind of tell, sometimes looking at the floor space helps get some perspective. Here is your bathroom. So over here you've got just the walk-in large shower. You could do a shower tub combo there if you wanted to. Um, and then you do have, this shows the dual sinks. And I'm trying to stay out of the mirror. <laughs> um, and then here you've got just the little water closet. You do have a window there, so it's kind of nice. And then let's go look at the rest of them. So then you've got this next bedroom here. Again, good size. This one has um, a wall closet. Oops, this one has a wall closet here. If you can see, just kind of standard size on that. And then here's the secondary bathroom. So standard with just the one sink, you could also do dual sinks in here and there's plenty of space for it which is nice. And then this has in here shower tub combo. They've got the upgraded um, with the tile instead. They are cleaning all the windows right now. So that's why the screen is off and all that fun stuff. This one actually has a guest house too. So this is one of the single level guest house. So I kind of thought it maybe I'd show you, I don't know, in terms of um, backyard space, that's kind of what you're looking at. And you've got that guest house, so 
just to give some perspective. And then you've got a hall closet here. And then let's take you back. And then you've got two more bedrooms. Actually, one more bedroom, sorry, back here. And same thing, kind of mirrors that um, other one that's up here on the back side. And then this is your laundry room. So kind of nice, you've got it upstairs with all of your bedrooms, so you're not hiking your laundry downstairs. Kind of nice. So that's our, that's the plan 20, oh, sorry. Right that's here. plan 2400. And I will send this to you guys in just a second.